Hey guys, how you doing? I'm Dave the Usher. Welcome to the Gamer Play. We're playing Final Fantasy IV for the SNES. So I was talking about side quests. I say we do uh, one of them. Okay, here's where the sealed uh, cave is. Okay, now we got. Uh... Okay, I think I think this is the land to the summoned monsters. Yeah. Right. Um, as you can see, I'm going to cast Float or Levitate on me. See the little wings? Okay, now, uh, see those glowing orange uh, squares? If you step on them, they take life away. Therefore, that's why you cast Float on yourself. Now I'm immune to it, but I'm not immune to these battles. Here's another good reason to have it. Earthquake doesn't affect me. Sorry, Arachno bitch. <laughs> okay. Buh bye. So we're going to the land of summons. I believed we were told uh, to do that by uh, King Baron, the the real king. Yeah, as you could see from that chest, I've been here actually. I haven't really... I just collected all the chests in the cave. So, I mean, nothing too big. Uh, I've upgraded my weapons for Edge and Cecil and Kane. I got the de the uh, Defender sword on. Uh, I can't remember the sword name I got for Edge. It's, uh... uh I'll show you. Okay, come on. So I got defenders on. Oh yeah, and I got Aga shields. There's Rosa. Rodia. Edge. Ah, forged. Right. Yeah, I'm badass. Oh, I'm taking the stupid way. Why didn't I remember where the fucking door is? It shouldn't take me that long to, uh... Oh, God. Surprised. Every time I run, I hit the floor. Alright, that's it. I'm not taking this shit. Hurry up, Cecil. Damn it. Still alive? I'm a little stronger. Not that much, though. The next time I do some level up, I don't think I'll do it in the sealed cave. Okay, now I have to put Levitate on myself every time I enter a new floor. Kind of annoying, but whatever. Big deal. Okay, uh, up. Over here. Yes. Come on, make it. Ugh. One more time. So basically, the uh, Land of Summons is a place where uh, monsters live in peace, basically. The monsters, like, Rydia can summon. Sort of. Yeah, this is the same place where they took her in and taught her many things and blah blah blah. I've uh, gotten all the chests from here as well, as you can see. Uh, 
Uh, and for those of you who don't know, there's a secret passage right here. Some chests there. There's a bow for uh, Rosa and Rydia. Good upgrade. I know. Anything else over here? No. Okay, now we're going up a level. Or down, who the hell knows. Hey look, a chocobo. Come here. I'd say. This one's a little slower. Even though I got those chests, you can see they're uh, full over there still. Funny glitch. Weapon shop, armor shop. No, they aren't. Move, 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 move. Okay, let's enter the library here. A few books. <laughs> let's check out some of these books. Oh, more books. Hey, move. I'm trying to read. Master of the Ocean, huh? Leviathan? Move. Well, it looks like we know what we're going to have to be doing here. How am I going to read that book on the other side of that little exit thing? Aha! Well, that was worth it. Okay, now, what do we got here? <clears throat> Let's try talking with this guy. I'm just some old fool. Okay, are we all healed up? Oh, no, we aren't. Okay. I must prove it in combat. 
I sure do. Okay, so we're gonna fight the queen. And I'll show you the way to beat her. She has the power to... She's like a white mage expert, basically. She can cast Cure 3, Cure 4, Life 2, uh, and such. So how am I supposed to beat that? I'm looking at the clock. Alright, well I take the Reflect, and I put it on her. Can't cast magic on her, of course, but you know, whatever. What can you do? However, I can summon beasts. Anyway guys, I'm about out of time. I want to thank you all for watching and stay tuned for the next part.